Hey guys, welcome back to Texit, where today we're gonna, um, uh, we're gonna start to get geared up. As in, what I wanna do is work with the, uh, Tinkers mod, which should allow me to make, like, really good, well, I said really good swords, I hope really good swords, and really good armour, which will help me a lot in this mod, because literally everything wants to kill you. Literally everything. And I'm pretty sure one good thing about this mod that I found out, like, a second ago, which will make my treehouse a lot better, is, if we go here, not the fence, um, it is an elevator block, it's one of these, now if I'm not wrong, this should allow me to like, just basically go up and down, and I assume it'll be, you crouch on it, go down, jump on it, go up, and it'll make, because it'll mean that I don't have to have a staircase in here, which would take up quite a lot of room, which would make it look even worse. But to be honest, I still need to actually, you know, sort this room out and make it look, well, like a room, actually. That would just be a good, that would be a step up. Um, but yeah, for now, we will try, actually, I think I've still got a chest down here. I do. So I need ender pearls and wool, which I obviously don't have. However, if I'm not wrong, this actually, um, yeah, increased skull and ender pearl drops. So I'm going to take that. And hopefully this will... Oh, I was meant to throw that out. Hopefully it'll let me get a lot more ender pearls. Do I have any wool? I don't think I do. No, it doesn't look like it. Um, right, so what I'll do quickly is I will go and get some ender pearls and some wool. And then I'll carve out this room because I'm going to put it down here somewhere. Like literally just down below here. I don't know how far down, but it's going to go somewhere down there. Uh, but yeah, I will see you when I've done that. Right, so I finally finished out hollowing this room, and so if we go down, it's actually quite a bit bigger than I thought it would be, to be honest. So this is where the actual smeltery is going to be, at least I think that's what you call it. So it's going to be three blocks, three blocks, three blocks, three blocks, and it's it does actually leave quite a lot more room than I thought it would. So that's actually quite good, and so we just put these down quickly. You got the part builder, tool station, and stencil table. You do need the tool forge. But there is one problem with that, is in that I can't make it yet. Because you need tool forge. Where is it? Is this it? Wait, what? Why are the... I mean, hang on. It's tool forge, block of steel leaf. What does that mean? Okay, so you, so you still need the seared tiles, but you can actually... You can make different ones. That's actually really cool. Look, so... Yeah, that's actually, that is actually really cool. Right, so, I mean, I only really need one that I can make, to be honest. It doesn't need to be anything really fancy. Iron al That one, I could do. So, yeah, but I can't make... How do you make iron alloy? That's the thing. I have no idea how to make most of these things. Block of reds. I could make that. That one would be really easy to make. Glowstone. Um, yeah, I think I might just have to settle with the redstone one. To be quite honest with you. Okay, so I'm pretty sure I've got everything for, like, the, the actual smeltery thing. So if I'm not wrong, what I need is seared bricks. I need a seared tank. A faucet. A seared drain. And that, a furnace controller. And I'm pretty sure I've got everything for these. So it should be this. Surrounded by seared brick. That makes the controller. And I think it was that for the drain. And then the faucet was like that. Yep. And then the tank. The tank was, if I'm not wrong, it's just a piece of glass around by that. Yeah, good. Now I can just make the rest into... Well, I say the rest. I can make most of the rest into um, seared bricks. I don't know how many I actually need. I just know it's a few. So like that. Oh, that wasn't meant to go there. Let's pick that back up. Do that, and I need one more. There we go. And then I can put the tank there. I can get these three, and then the... the how does the drain go again? Like that? I don't really remember. I think that's right. And that goes like that. Wait a minute. How do I open this? I think I need this. Unless I need lava in first. But you, you should be able to, unless it's a different, like, as in, it, unless the mod's different, because usually what it was is you'd open this by right-clicking, and then you'd put, like, blocks and stuff in, and then they'd appear in here. It's also just occurred to me, well, I need to change the floor. 
As in, if I leave it like that, will it start burning? I'm not, I'm not entirely sure on that. I guess we'll just find out. <laughs> I'll leave it a day and then I'll come back and the entire tree will have burnt down. Right, well, anyway, um, actually, it's just occurred to me. I haven't finished everything because I need, what is it again? Like, I can't actually remember what it's called. It's, um, it's, you put it there and then you put the, like, the stencils and stuff there and it's actually how you make the parts. So without it, it's, I, I can't really do much. What's it called? It's... It's like a, it's like a, it's basically like a tool forge, but it's not a tool forge. Yeah, so I'm, I'm just a massive idiot, and I, I had the wrong thing. You need the smeltery controller, not the furnace controller. That's a completely different thing. So then what you do once you've done that is you go in, and you literally, you just put your, like, ores or whatever in. I went and got a load of copper from them, them tower things, because one of them had loads of copper armor, and, and I think what you need to do now is get these so i've already made the um like the i don't even know what to call these because what you do with these is you put them there if i'm not ah it's not damn i really thought it was but evidently i'm wrong but yeah what you need to do is i think actually i think gold might work i mean it's a bit of a waste as in spend using gold for this is a bit of a waste but i mean it might work because what you need to do is you need to create a cast of these and then with the cast you can actually make the good things and what i'm going to try and make is a um it's a, a dark steel pickaxe which honestly i'm not sure if it's worth but i kind of want a good pickaxe just because it could be helpful honest <laughs> honestly there's no real reason i i just i'm just making a pickaxe because i don't really think currently there's a sword that i can make that's better than the platinum one i mean i could be wrong saying that but i don't think i am because actually it tells you in this book what like the damage is so, I mean, I've got, oh, five, I've got some of that. You know, I might actually, actually saying that though, because it's, look, it, that's its, um, what would you call it? It's ability sort of thing, and it can teleport enemies away, which could be good, but if I want to kill the enemy, it's quite bad, because then I have to chase after it. So, it's, I mean, it's good, and it's bad at the same time. But what does dark steel, because I know that's a thing. Dark steel, there it is. Six, yes, yeah, six is one, one and a half less than that, so that's pretty bad. Pulsating iron, that's a lot worse. Um, I mean, that's, that is good, but, I mean, I don't, I don't want the teleport away thing. And then, I think there's only, like, two other things, or three other things, but currently I can't get most of them. There's, like, um, that, no, well, that, that's actually worse still. 8.2, mali, man. My, I can't say I can't say that, but I know what it is. It's um, it's cobalt and ardite, like smelted together. And then there is one more thing that's better: evil infused. Actually, there's two more things: D demonic metal and yeah, that's it. So they're, they're the only things that are better, or at least I think that are better, uh, for a sword. So yeah, you can make a gold cast. So we'll make we'll just make a pickaxe for now, and it, honestly, it doesn't matter because we can just get like a sword later on. So I want dark steel to be the, uh, the, this. And then I want, oh, I didn't have enough, did I? Yeah, that's not good. All I'm saying that, that thing says progress is going up. So maybe it is just setting. Oh, it was, yeah, that's good. Right, so I need that as that. And then pick that up, put the tool rod down. And then we want the gold back. And then we're going to make a... Actually, let me have a look. I can't remember what I was going to make with the tool rod. I think it was either... It was either um, pulsing iron or whatever it's called. Pulsating iron or the other one that I've got. Pulsating iron, so... I think I was going to make a handle out of that. And then I was going to make a... One of these out of that. Because that, that ability is actually pretty good. A chance to... Um, teleport everything you mine straight into inventory that's pretty handy so i've got the tool rod brilliant now i need to make i've already forgotten what it was uh what what did i say it would be so it's it's not the vibrant alloy what i've called it must be pulsating so let's pull that in i kind of don't like how it takes a while to do i i, I mean it's cool but it, i feel like it should just do instantly 
last thing and yeah basically with the tinker's construct mod what i want to do is just stack myself up but at least i say that there could be another mod in here that gives you way better stuff but for the time being this will be good so that and then come on speed yourself up so it is this tool forge and you want to go for the pickaxe pickaxe head tool rod that and there's a dark pickaxe now that should also be quite good because i do have uh, some mining plans soon i want to go and get like loads of materials and stuff so that i can actually make use of the tinker's construct mod because i mean obviously i kind of want to make use of it otherwise it's just a waste of time and also i think what i'm going to do if i haven't already mentioned is make this look a bit nicer like maybe have some pillared blocks either side and i think that should look a lot better but yeah i think it is about time to end so i will see you next time